Greetings, welcome to Nordic Ashes Survivors of Ragnarok. I'm Catherine of Sky, and I don't know if this is actual um, runic words. They have spelled it in runes, S-U-R-V-I-V-O-R-S, uh, etc. Um, I think they just probably had the English words, but some of the, some of our English words are, are directly connected to Norse words. But anyway, I love this game. I'm so excited. It is out, everyone. It is out. Uh, it is difficult. It's really hard. Um, so we're going to try it and get things going. All we have right now is Axel Dur. Um, we have a new skin for him. Conquer any realm 10 times with Axel Dur to unlock this skin. We have other characters, Thera and Hafgrim. Uh, conquer Midgard with Thera, conquer Midgard with Axel Dur. So we have these different characters that you have to unlock. Um, I'm going to start with the, um, hmm, I like the Iron Hammer. I do not like the Stormbringer. This seems to fire in a random direction, which is not toward enemies, and I don't get that. I wish that that was more targeted toward enemies because right now it's like you could be right next to an enemy and it goes the other way into nothingness like literally not hitting anything so i feel like it's kind of a useless weapon so the iron hammer is um a very ranged weapon so we're going to start with that one and then we're going to get the nagling and then all three of them basically as we go now we have several different uh realms that we can go to of course nothing is unlocked um unless we go to midgard so we're gonna go to midgard we also have a uh, difficulty levels now that's been introduced with the game of course we are at normal and uh hopefully we're gonna get a leaf so if we survive we get a leaf at the end of this run Okay, let's go. And there's multiple parts of this run, let me tell you. Now, the best part of things to do in this game is to explore. You need to go and find stuff. Uh, especially these boxes, they have um, they have coins in them usually, and you can buy stuff on the little shops on the map with these coins. So, oh god, come on, come on, come on. Just shoot things. Okay, I'm trying to shoot the box and all these darn enemies get over here. It's a bit frustrating. They do have... Um, hit boxes for sure so you oh there we go there's some money oh we got a whole stack of coins that's fantastic all right that's five a lot of things are five coins so that's actually really great oh we got plenty of enemies here nice so we'll we'll level up in just a second this game has a really interesting different level up system to something like vampire survivors or whatever um, and each character has access to unique weapons. So it's very, very different from Vampire Survivors itself, but definitely is in that kind of auto shooter survival kind of genre that I love so much. Okay, let's go here. Let's go ahead and level up. We have five points. What I usually do is like give this uh, hammer an extra point. Then I want to travel along the tree and unlock everything else. So let's get this one, get this one, get this one. And we have one point left. We can go for this one. And this also gives us access to an infinity whirlwind, which is like a superpower, which you can trigger yourself. Okay, so we have... This is nice. We can do the burning ground. This chest is 15. Now, that is worth getting, absolutely. Because it has an upgrade to the weapons themselves, giving them, like, more area or damage or things like that. So it's really, really useful. Let's see. We have five points. Is that enough? Might, might be enough, actually. Let's go and get uh, a few more. Okay, I like how the, the crows get <laughs> damaged by fire on the ground. Apparently these are like slightly walking crows, or maybe it's just too hot underneath where they're flying. That could be too, I don't know. I find it a little bit funny, a little bit funny. There we go. Let's just collect all this XP that's on the ground here. So this is a pretty nice damage spell, this, the fire on the ground, because, you know, enemies chase you, so they're going to get in the fire a lot, and uh, you get a lot of uh, nice kills from that. You can also upgrade the damage on the fire, uh, but we really just want to travel that tree and hopefully get access to the sword. Let's go there. Okay, so we're going to take, we have to choose either this one, which is Fury, increases damage you inflict uh, in 2.5 times each time you receive damage from any source. Eh... Not really that crazy about that. Berserker is pushes back some enemies, increases the following stats for seven seconds. Now this is, it kind of triggers automatically. So yeah, I don't know. But this one, I don't know. The, the, I don't want to get hit. <laughs> so let's go with this one. 
And then this one, uh, let's get the damage on this one and the Nagling. Perfect. Now, can we afford this guy? Yeah, we can. No, we can't. Five points. Okay, so let's start traveling. Actually, let's get some damage on this one. I like the sword as well. It's a nice starting weapon. This gives us more damage, but let's start with the sword. Let's get another point on this guy, and then we'll kill stuff. Now we have two weapons, which is great. It is very great. See? Now we have a little bit more protection closer to us. Oh, we got a mini boss. That's great. Cool. These little mini... Oh, boy. That's not good. That's not good. We're getting hit too much. I feel like I should travel a little bit because um, I'm not seeing... Uh, we need to go and see if we can find some health potions. Also, those trees have hit boxes too, and that's a little bit scary. Just a tiny bit scary. Oh, there's a chest. A chest dropped. Woo. Oh, these are great. Chests are fantastic. Okay, we got a choice now of stuff. Okay, uh, duration? Duration? Bran, damage. Nagling up, though. Oh, man, but damage up. Urgh, fire shoes. That's those fire shoes. You know what? I think it's the fire shoes that we get the damage up on. Oh, no! This is bad. This is really bad. Because I don't... I need more health. Sometimes the enemies do drop health potions, but it's quite rare, as you see. Um, at least I think it's the enemies. I, I don't think it's the, the torches. Because we've been through those multiple times. Let's go and find a new area to harvest stuff in. Okay, okay. It's fine, it's fine. Uh, let's just... We have seven points. Let's get this one. And we can walk up toward... Uh, oh, this one costs... Oh, we haven't gotten this one. That's why. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's fine. Let's go. Infinity Whirlwind is now on R. Right, we want to travel and see if we can find some stuff, some boxes, or some a store, anything that we can find here. Oh, there's a, ah, uh, there's a dangerous thing over there. Okay, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Ah. Okay, there we go. We want these boxes. There we go. I think we got some kind of money from that one, maybe. Okay, we don't want to go too near to that one. That is dangerous. So this usually. There's usually a prize. Oh, it's got some boots there, but I can't afford it because I have no health. Basically, those things will damage you, these spikes, and there's no way to avoid it. You can't jump over it or anything like that, so it's a little bit frustrating, those. Let's see. Let's see what's in this box here. There we go. A little bit of money. A little bit. Oh, 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 oh. This is a this is a nice beastie. Okay, cool, cool. All right. Oh, stop it. Don't follow me, dude. That ain't cool. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Right? Hmm. Okay, let's keep on going here. See what, what else we can find. There we go. Nice. Oh, we have a kill 350 enemies for a big crystal. That looks like maybe an XP crystal. I've never actually seen one of those before. Oh, that was cool. That was good. So let's go in that uh, bo that area and kill those things. Now, we have 12 uh, monies, which I think we needed 15 for that box or something. Not actually sure, but this is probably worth it to kill these things. I've never seen that big kind of crystal before, so we will see, I guess. We'll see what it is. You can see how the souls are going into this uh, well here. Oh, help, help. Oh, God. That's a lot. That's a lot. Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay, we have points. Let's go and get the next thingy. Let's get the hammer or the, the sword. And, uh, not sword. It's an axe. I know it's an axe. It's an axe. Uh, the more weapons you have, obviously, your survivability definitely increases because, yeah, you can uh, you can just kind of uh, kill stuff in your way, basically. Though, even though it's kind of random which way the, uh, the weapons go, but it's still better than having nothing. That is the not ideal situation that we have ourselves in. Okay. Actually, we're not in it. We have all the weapons, which is great. Which is really great. We have two points. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. We're doing pretty well here. Uh, except for the fact that we only have one half a heart. Would love to get a health potion here. But I'm not seeing any drop. And I'm not actually sure what drops the health potions. I thought it was maybe mini bosses. Let's just check these chests. The chest might have it as well. Nope, they just had money. They just had money. 
Let's go and get the money. Oh, God. All right, let's go back to our... Oh, there's another chest here. Oh, I got a health potion. Yes, two! <gasps> Lucky! Oh, boy. Oh, boy. This is scary. This is super scary. This is really scary. Hello. Excuse me. Excuse me. I need to come through. Coming through. Coming through. Okay. Okay. That's fun. Yay. Okay. All right. We had two bosses there. That was kind of crazy. All right. Let's get our points sorted out here. I kind of want this up a little bit. Let's get this one up as well. Um, Bran. These are the fire shoes. Um, we can get... The area is up and duration is up. This is projectile speed. I don't care about this. This is the burn damage to four to seven. Let's go. Twelve. This is a really powerful thing, I feel, in general, because like a lot of the enemies just walk over it. So it's nice to kind of, you know, see if we can get that going. It'll it'll help kill them more or finish them off or something. That would be nice. Oh boy. Oh boy. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's horrible. Howie. Hurdy. 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 Okay. 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 We're gonna we're gonna R on this guy. Dude. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna kill everything. Killing everything. Let's go. We're in a whirlwind. It's happening. Oh whoops. We ran out of whirlwind. <laughs> we ran out of whirlwind. Sad times. Sad sad times. We have five points again. I kind of like that you can just, like, choose to upgrade when you want to. Oh, the Scavenger King. We have a boss. Okay. Let's get weapons for this. I um, feel like this is important. If we're close to the the thing, yeah. Damage up. No. Everything. Does everything cost two points? Everything. Okay. I'll take this. Sure. Why not? Just spending all the points, basically. Oh, this guy is dangerous also because he is kinda, kinda, kinda. Run, 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 run. But remember, we upgraded our sword, so that's gonna do a lot of damage close by. There we go, and just kinda hit him close by. And there was a potion, yes! Ha <laughs> ha, we're almost to full health. This is fantastic. Let's make sure that we kill some more enemies here while we're killing this boss guy. Okay, dude, go away, go away. Okay, excuse me. We're doing pretty well here, doing really well. I'd really like to not kill him before I get the rest of the, the souls here. That's kind of important, because I think after we... If we win with this guy, we're going to be transported. So I kind of want to... Oh, no. It was so close. Okay, so we can buy stuff here. I don't know what the Gnuki is about. Let's get this thing. Yay. We got a diamond. Um. Ooh. What are those blades? Urgh. Take those. Yep. All right. Twin blades. What did we get? Damage received is increased by half a heart. Eh, no, but we have damage plus 35%. Okay, we can actually get these weapons, go into Whirlwind with these and get the uh, uh, prizes if we're fast. Darn it. Otherwise, you can't get those or and the timer doesn't reset, which is unfortunate. Okay, so we did that. All right, do we want, this looks like a heart container. Maybe, no. All right, what did it do? Did nothing. No! Uh, where is our, do we, I guess we don't get access to the glossary. Okay, I guess that's it. So we go down when we're done. Okay. Okay, oh, we're still here, Never mind. Okay, it's looking good. Though all the XP has disappeared, as you have noticed, probably. It's no longer on the ground. So we must have been there for quite some time. Last breath, okay. Plus 35 damage percent when you only have one red heart or less. Don't worry, that will happen, I'm quite sure, at some point. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have eight points to spend. Uh, let's spend them. Let's go with... Um, this one can go up. We're going to get area and duration up with this. 
10 points for the next upgrade. All right, so we have one point left. That took a lot of points from us. That's okay. It's kind of a nice thing. Obviously waiting for it to reset now. And now we go on the quest for more money as well. Or more more unlocky thingies. I kind of like this. The, the unlocky thingies are uh, very like the shrines in um, Spellbook Demon Slayers. I really like... Oh my god, I'm getting killed. This is bad. No. <gasps> oh no. I died. Oh dear. Okay, well, we did a thing. So, the problem now is, you think, oh yes, we have, this is a roguelike. Can we spend points in Yggdrasil? No. No, you can't. I feel like these are way expensive as well. 25 leaves, this level. Yeah, that means you have to win 25 times, and we haven't even won once. Because killing that final boss is not actually a win. It's not actually a win. No! You have to have more. There's like waves of enemies. It's like, oh my god, what do they want from me? You know, really? It's a lot. I think it's a lot. Okay. Hello? Let's kill stuff, please. Jeez, that took a while. Okay. There's another crate this way I saw. Okay. Trying to get the XP. Yo, thank you. Um, so anyway, I probably shouldn't have upgraded that whirlwind at the end there because I think, let's just get this one up. We'll conquer these chests better. Jeez. See, that's the real, real hardship here is the chests. Please chests. Go, go, go. No, 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 no. Oh gosh. Okay. Okay. There we go. There we're actually getting some kind of something here. No. Okay, chest still. Still not opening that chest. That's annoying. Let's get this going. Projectile speed. We don't care about. The fire is pretty good. Oh, we don't have enough to level that one up. I want to level that burn damage up to at least the four. So we finally got that box open. Jeez, had one gold coin there. It's not too bad. Not too bad. All right, there we go. We have seven points now. Let's move. Let's get this one up one more notch. Get this one, Berserker. Let's get. Hello? Oh, I forgot to get the haste. Okay. Oh, we don't didn't get the sword just yet. Ju not just yet. Not just yet. It'll be there. It'll be. It'll come. It'll come. No worries. Anyway, I really love the music of this game. Oh, cool! We found a thing. Sea urchin. What is this? As one empty red heart container. I'll take it. That means if we find potions, we can make use of that. That's very nice. I thought the thing for the heart container was like a little heart cookie. Maybe that one adds a full red heart container. I don't know. That's kind of cool. Very cool. Very, very cool. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But yeah, a reminder not to take the blades. Holy crap, those are dangerous. Okay, let's get... Let's get this one up. Let's get the fire up. Get this. Oh, I forgot. To oh, jeez. Ha! Ah! I just need one point, though, to unlock it, so it's not too bad. Okay, and we got the XP from that guy. Okay, that's good, good, good. Let's go and grab this XP. It is beautiful. We want our XP, please. Careful of those red and green trails. They are very dangerous. They will hurt you. They will hurt you. Okay, this one makes it easier to get those boxes, for sure. All right, putting damage there. Good. Very good. Oh, there's an XP from the boss. Guy up there. Let's go, let's go. Okay, nice. Very nice. Getting stuff and things. All right, we got a stone here. I forgot what the stone is. There is a glossary, but I wish it was more accessible in game because I don't see it here anywhere, unfortunately. That's okay. No worries, no worries. 
but it definitely is going to pay to know what stuff does, because obviously there's stuff that has kind of negative side effects on occasion. Mm-hmm. Just slightly. Nice. Going into Berserker mode here. We have a potion. Yay. Jeez, this is Dodge Simulator here. Holy crap. We have four points. Let's take those four points and do stuff with them. Let's take these up. Okay, good. Doesn't really matter on these tiny mobs like this, but it does definitely matter on the mini bosses and obviously on on the, the wave boss. Um, okay, we got a stone. What does that do for us? Damage plus one. Okay, so it wasn't really great. But that's why it also had a lower uh, price kill kill number. It was only 100 kills. So that was kind of not, you know, not a huge investment of time. It was fine. Okay, this thing is the one where you got to take damage to get in here. But you get the thingy, butter cookie, which is full red heart container. So you basically pay for it with, with life, that one. That one had money in it. Okay, very good, very good. Come on, dudes. Come on, dudes. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay. Uh, but now we have many, many uh, heart containers, which is pretty great. Pretty great. Let's go and find more stuff. Let's find more stuff. Because traveling on the map is pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, torches definitely don't get, you know, deleted. I found that really funny that that's in a lot of games. Like, yeah, delete the torch and you get stuff from it. And I'm like, okay, food? What? How does this work exactly? Oh, there's a potion. Yes. Urgh, tasty. Tasty potions. Nice, nice. But you also kind of want to stay around and farm a little bit, like in an area, if you have a lot of enemies. Because uh, the XP, yep, that's what gets you damage. So, oh my god, there's a thing over there. What is that? That little heart charm there? Ooh, that looks tasty. I don't know what it is, but I want it. Let's go and get it. Let's go get it. These red birds seem to go random places. Okay. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, wow, 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 wow. I don't like those red birds at all. Whoopsies. Got stuck on the tree there. Okay, I can't go that way very easily. Okay, we have four points we can spend. I guess we can get the other weapon right now, maybe down here and see what we got here uh this is the damage up that's only two and a half percent or whoa that's better 10 percent cool 15 percent uh no points left <laughs> no points left it's fine it's just fine okay let's go here oh there's a chest over on the right oh, i didn't even see that potion drop that's kind of cool these red birds are very unpredictable they don't go toward you so it's like huh it's very weird. There we go. More money. As you see, like at the end of the wave, you have a little store that you can buy stuff in. That's kind of nice. Go away, bird. Shoo. There's a mini boss chasing me as well, I see. Two mini bosses, actually. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, okay, okay. No! Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Go away. Go away. Go away. No, 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 no. I don't want you here. Excuse me. Nine, 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 nine. Okay, let's get close enough to pick up the XP, but not close enough to die. There we go. Oh, boy. Ooh, lots of money from those chests. Holy fuzzy cats. That's nice. That's a lot of money. Cool. Very cool. All right, let's check out the level ups again. Let's try to get the next weapon. We also have Thunder Armor. This is pretty nice. It's basically like shocks enemies. I think I want this to go up cooldown area um is this this is attack speed that's nice all right there we go we got stuff it yeah it's basically like a what do you call it like a lightning kind of a armor thingy it's pretty cool it's pretty cool to like, okay go away dude go away dude go away i want my xp Oh my god, this is a bit scary. It's kind of weird when they die so far away, but it's like, it's probably the, the flames on the floor kind of thing. Oh, there's a health potion, thank goodness. Oh boy, oh boy. 
Okay, the scavenger king. We got to the king again. Let's see if we can... We'll have a little bit more leeway here because we're not trying to fight in a circle anymore. <laughs> ah, but we have boxes. Oh, how did that hurt me? What? Was there an enemy behind it? That's so weird. No! Oh, man. And I didn't even use my points. That's the worst of it. Dang it. Oh, continue. Let's go and look at our relics because they are in the glossary here. We can look and see what you have here and how, you know, what they are, which is nice. 25 gold on that one. Wow. Okay. One. Okay. One red harder less. Yep. Those are great. Thunder armor. Ragdoll. This is an interesting one we haven't come across yet, uh, but this is really fun. Um, it basically just like deploys and all the enemies kind of like go toward it. It's like a target dummy kind of thing. Infinity Whirlwind. I love the graphics on this. It looks super cool. Um, but yeah, I love like the chill, I don't know, Viking vibe of this uh, game. It's fantastic. I just really enjoy it. All right, let's do one more run and we'll see how far we get. 